Well, a construction worker is freed after more than eight hours in a trench. Our John Gonzalez is live in Falls Church this morning to explain the tedious work to try to get him out. John, what a story. Jimmy, what a story. The rescue ended after midnight this morning, and we understand tubing was used to alleviate some of the pressure around the man and to keep him warm while he was down below about 20 feet deep. Imagine being trapped in this trench for about eight hours. A construction worker miraculously this morning is safe after being rescued and treated at the hospital. He had been working at this home turned construction site since Wednesday. We'll take a look at our amazing video we captured as he is pulled from that deep trench. Officials believe all of the heavy rain the last couple of days saturated the ground and may have actually played a factor in what they're calling the first collapse. Initially, the worker was covered in about three feet of dirt covering his legs and feet. Well, when rescuers arrived, there was a second collapse at the deepest point. The dirt covered the man's chest as concerned residents looked on. We asked a neighbor, you know, what's going on? And uh, apparently a uh, man was, was stuck in a ditch. He's been stuck in a ditch for a couple hours. Uh, they were doing some plumbing work. Now, rescuers with Virginia Task Force One were able to install a trench box to prevent yet another collapse and again safely get this man out of that 20 foot hole. And again this morning, he is doing well. Unbelievably, this is still a very unstable site here, so it doesn't appear there will be any work done this morning. Reporting live, John Gonzalez, ABC 7 News.